Alright guys, welcome back here to my Clicker Heroes playthrough. So ladies and gentlemen, we are hot on the heels here of episode 194. This is now episode 195. Five more episodes left until the big, big, big episode 200 special, man. Get ready for it guys, it is going to be insane. I can't believe we only have five episodes left. I really do hope that you're all to enjoy this episode. Thank you all so, so much for watching as always. We actually managed to pass 90 likes on the last episode, dude. I asked for 50 and you guys gave me 90. Thank you all so much, man. Seriously, you guys have no idea how freaking awesome that is for me to see. Um, I'm aiming for 50 likes again in this episode. I really hope we can beat it like last episode, dude. I don't even want 90. I just want to at least beat 50. I know you guys can always push me over that limit. So thank you all so much, man. Let's kick this episode off now. Who knows how far we're going to get in today's episode, dude. But we have over 110 comments to read out. It's going to be one hell of an episode. Here we go. Let's kick it off now, shall we? So the first thing we want to do is click on this clickable here. There we go. Very nice. Uh, I reckon the next thing we'll do is get Alabaster to 500 if we can afford it. Looks like we can. Beautiful. Now let's guild up Alabaster by, I guess, 212 gilded statuses. Done. Now let's try and level up Alabaster as much as we can here. There we go. So now we're managing to destroy the mobs again. That's very good stuff, obviously. Uh, we have a gilded status here by the looks of it. What's it going to be? Chiron. I've never actually unlocked Chiron. That's really interesting. So that's a new hero, guys. I've never seen him before, ever. <laughs> Pretty cool. Okay, so that's that. Um, we have Astraea next. I reckon we'll get Alabaster to 1000, though. It might take us a while. Then we'll level up Astraea here, whatever the hell her name is. <laughs> Don't actually know how to pronounce that one too well. She does seem to be doing a lot of damage though, doesn't she? Hmm, very interesting. I reckon I'll keep leveling up Alabaster though for now. Let's check out the mercenaries for today. Here's uh, Primal Boss. Ooh, level 2150. That's down and out. See you later, dude. Just flew past that boss. Good stuff. Right, so let's go into Alabaster again. Just have to wait to save up enough gold to actually upgrade Alabaster here, dude. Far out. It's going to take ages. Um, let's see how the clan's going. Now, the clan has been emptied, so the clan clean-out did happen last night, like I said it would, guys. So, the clan's actually empty at the moment. So, be sure to join back now. Um, you must be at least level 1500 to join. So, yeah, don't apply if you're under that, or you're just going to get denied. <laughs> Alright, let's see if you guys beat the clan bosses. Graham, he did. And who beat it this time? Graham again. Good job, dude. 5.9 million souls right there on hand. Uh, just got extra. Look at that, we can actually ascend for like nearly 120 million souls. That is freaking awesome, dude. I cannot wait to ascend again. It's going to be freaking... Oh, I can't even explain it. As you guys can tell, I'm really excited here. I'm saying freaking a lot, and that's how you know I'm really excited. <laughs> but it's going to be fantastic, seriously. Let's check out the mercenaries. And we lost the mercenaries. Son of a bitch, dude. Okay. Damn it, that sucks. What are we going to do? We have to collect some gold rewards here. There you go, just collected some gold rewards. Let's go for the new mercenary. Let's go for the gold. There we go. Not going to collect that quick ascension worth just yet, because we can currently get a quick ascension for 70 million. So that's, we'll get 40% of 70 million. Pretty cool. Alright, 650 right now. Just cruising through the levels still, dude. Like, uh, legit, I've never been this far in the game. So I have no idea what to expect coming up here when it comes to the hero unlocks and stuff. We're slowly getting Alabaster up here, which is good, of course. Might take us a while, though, by the looks of it. 2,167. That's a level one at the moment, guys. It's going pretty well, isn't it? Can we get it to 2,200, though? I wonder if we can actually get our overall zone to 2,200. That would be quite the achievement for me. I'd really want to see if I can pull that off. I don't know if I can, though. Grant the general there. Let's put the Guild of Status into Alabaster again. Let's upgrade Australia here. Australia. I can't pronounce her name at all. There we go. That's her now. No worries. Alright. Come up to 2,175. Two million souls, dude. That's excellent. Okay. So we're slowly approaching two, uh, 2,200 zone. 
It's just gonna take a while. Hopefully not too long though. I'll be devastated if it does take ages. By the looks of it though, we are going pretty well right now. So I don't see us slowing down. No, oh, like eventually, like yeah, eventually we will slow down a lot. But at the moment, I think we're going pretty well, just by judging the DPS that we're doing to these mobs. I hope I don't jinx it though, guys. I probably will though, knowing my luck. Um, I can keep trying to save up for Alabaster here if I really want to. Choices are hard though. Let's put some Gilded statuses into Australia here, if we can. Put 10 into her. It's doing quite a bit of damage. Alright, do you know what? Let's lob all the Gilded statuses in there. Alright, so I've just chucked all our Gilded statuses into Australia here. Um, is it Astria? Astria? Do you reckon that sounds a bit better? Who knows? She seems to be doing more damage than Alabaster, to be honest. The only issue is she's really expensive, so I don't know what the hell I'm going to do here. We will eventually hit the wall. I'm hoping we can at least get past 2,200. I'll be devastated if we don't. I probably will have to ascend soon, by the way, guys. It might just take a while, obviously. Either way, I think it's time we start reading out some comments, hey, from the previous episode. Here we go, guys. Just remember to leave a comment on this episode so I can read it out in the next episode, okay? Here we go. Alright, Dylan Noon, I got the second like for you. Thank you very much, Dylan. <laughs> that means heaps. Uh, Anthony Lillen, or Lionelli. That's it, Lionelli, I reckon. Uh, hi, hello, Anthony. Uh, Damien, I love your videos. Thank you very much, Damien. Master Universe, hey, I'm early. Nice video, by the way. Thank you very much, dude. Uh, Marcel, where is the calculator spreadsheet in your description? I only saw follow me on Facebook and play this game for free. And I told him to go to the sh show more tab. And I think now he's found it, which is all good. <laughs> um, Mattis, please help me. I don't know how to unlock some tier 4 ancients and some tier 1 ancients. I love your videos. They are the best. Uh, what do you mean there, dude? Like, what do you mean by tier 1 and tier 4? Like, I have every ancient unlocked right now, so I don't actually understand what you actually need some help with now. Um, the only way I can help you out, really, you just need enough hero souls to level up the ancients or to unlock them. <laughs> He just goes summon ancient. I'm not too under, like, I'm not too sure what the actual question is there. Hmm. But thank you very much for the compliment, by the way. Uh, Simone, thanks. Now when I hold shift and put guilds, oh no, and click it, it put guilds into the heroes. Thank you. It just takes a while. Yes, it does take a while, but I'm hoping that can help you out there. Um, if Q doesn't work for you, obviously, that's only if Q doesn't work because you can hold down Q to put all the guilded statuses into a hero, but shift's like an alternative, pretty much. Um, 2,190 at the moment, guys. Really good stuff. Blondie Bear, for episode 200, you should put all your souls into more ghoulers and see how it turns out, then transcend. <laughs> That'd be a complete mess, dude. Um, Simone, should I put all my guilds into Atlas when I get him to 225? Yeah, pretty much, dude. It all matters what level you're on in total. Like, is Atlas your highest hero? Because if so, definitely, um, put guild statuses into him. There's Atlas right there. <laughs> Just speaking about him. Pretty much if you're coming off the Masked Samurai, put your Gilded Statuses into Atlas next. Or even Terra. Um, Andretta Gaming, what is the best Ancient? I have Silatus and Liberatus, or Libertes. What else should I have? Um, you'd want to go with the, well, it sounds like, what are you going, Hybrid Spec or something? I would go with Mammon, Mimsy, um, Morgulez if you don't have him. Solomon for sure, and Atman, I'd say. Hopefully I didn't miss anything there. What else we got here? Oh, an Ancient of Shadow, of course, but he's really expensive, so I don't know if you can actually afford him. But if you can, definitely get him. What else we got, guys? Um. Hmm. Simone, got Terra for the first time. Good job, pal. Extreme Meme, another great video. Thank you very much, Extreme. Um, Oliver, I think I need help because my Steam says I've played six months of Cookie Heroes. Help me. <laughs> that just means you really like the game, mate. Um, Gohan, I just realized that Cadmia and stuff have a 5 times multiply in between 500, 700, 900. Hmm, apparently everything past Frostleaf does. Very interesting indeed. Can you play Infinity Hero? That's Karen who said that. What the hell is Infinity Hero? I've never heard of it, dude. Sorry. <laughs> Gordo Min, I hit 50 subs. Good job, man. Alright, what else we got here? Brandon. Whoa, this guy reads all the comments. Never saw such a dedicated YouTuber. Nice. Keep up the good work. Subbed. If 
By the way, join Infamous69. <laughs> That's his clan. Hopefully you get some members there, mate. Thank you very much for the comment, it means a lot. Uh, is there still a lot? Tell her there's there's a lot. What are you going to do for part 200? Is it a secret? Or do you need suggestions? I watch to the end. Thank you very much for watching to the end, Zestalot. That really means heaps, dude. Um, for part 200, I'm a little bit stuck still in what I have to do. But I'm sure I'll figure something out eventually, you know what I mean? Just might take a while for me to figure something out. Maybe you guys can leave some suggestions there. That would help a lot. Luca, go to level 1500 for Gilded Hero. Then, guild the next. Then he'll be 1000 when you guild him. Hope this helps. I think that's what majority of people do, but I usually get mine to 1,000, except for Alabaster right now. I think Alabaster, uh, the damage of Alabaster gets beaten from Australia here. Or oh, Astra, I think. Who knows. Arkham Gaming. On mobile, I used to have a Demigod plus 5 and 3 Demigod plus 2 Mercenaries. After less than a week, 3 of them died back to back, and only 1 Demigod remained. If I had resurrected them, it would have taken over 16,000 rubies. Holy crap, dude. But he plays on, uh, on mobile, sorry. So that probably explains that massive ruby cost. Uh, it's safe to say those mercs are rest in peace or rip. <laughs> yes. Wants the socks. Nice. I'm on zone 305. Good job, pal. Uh, Hombre Sun Sun. I just did it randomly. What look good? Also, what does the hybrid build mean? Is it active and idle combined? Also, at the time I transcend, I didn't know how to put my save game in the calculator. <laughs> Alright, so Hombre, he left, uh, or Hombre's, is it Hombre? I can't pronounce it. Either way, it's a gorilla that got shot. <laughs> um, he pretty much put random, that, like, souls into random outsiders and stuff. Definitely use a spreadsheet, dude. And um, hybrid build is, yeah, idle and active combined, pretty much. As soon as you hit a wall, you'd use uh, your idle, I uh, know your active build. Like right now, you ready? I'll use my active build right now. You ready guys? Here we go. There we go. So that's it. It's going to carry me all the way through now. How good is that? Seriously, look at that guys. This is actually going to get me past 2200 right now, thanks to my click build. That is really, really good. Legit, I think it's going to push us through with no issues. Holy crap. Done. 2,200. Achieving Zone Annihilator. Beat Zone 2,200. We're just going to achieve it unlock, baby. That is what I like to see. Hell yes. Okay. It's about time we got another achievement unlock. It's been a while, guys. It really has. That is freaking awesome. Okay. Beautiful stuff. That really makes me excited right now. Still don't have nowhere near enough gold to uh, level up Australia here. Um... Marcel, I did not get bonus hero cell from Transcendent Power because of Borg. Zone 100 doesn't give you bonus hero cells, that's exactly right. Zone 100 gives you nothing, pretty much, except for one hero cell. Um, criticals, put me in the next vid. There you go, Criticals, thanks for watching. Uh, the Awesome Genius, for the part 200 special, or 200 special, you should ascend and go from zone 1 to 2000. Holy crap, man, that would be an insane episode. But if that's what you guys really wanted to see, I reckon I could do it. You just gotta give me the time. <laughs> um, I better help click these mobs down, shouldn't I? Look at that, dude. Holy crap. What a struggle this is. So my active clicking is allowing me to, to defeat the mobs in one shot. That's when I get the crit hits anyway. Just I have to crit pretty much. It's pretty rare to crit <laughs> sometimes, isn't it? Alright, we'll leave that for now. Anyway. Um, have, have long is a 200 video, that's what Lucas wrote, I think it means how long. Uh, I have no idea yet, dude, you have to wait till we get the 200 episode, I guess. Uh, Lapius Lazul, what's the min, max, here, uh, high zone ever to enter the clan again? Great bit as usual, thank you very much, dude, and the minimum level is 1500, and the maximum is like 3500 or 4000. Um, I'm a person, your upgrades are hurting my head. <laughs> the most effective way to do it is the Masked Samurai until you fall Kamiya. Hmm. Then continue to upgrade them to you for the next hero, the next hero, the next hero. Hmm. Very interesting. I don't know about that still. Just, you gotta... I don't know. Everyone has their own way of doing it, I guess. Don't worry. Sure, go ahead. Now you're gonna keep using Samurai to unlock wet or wet. <laughs> I think that's how you pronounce it, isn't it? Wep-wa-wet. Rule fluff my ass off. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'm person. I don't know about that, dude. I've, I've never really... I've not been a fan of leveling up the Mars Samurai past 1500 or 2500. Like, he has his limits, seriously. You have to move on eventually. That's how the way... That, that's the way I look at it anyway. Um, Joe, how long until Clicker Heroes 2 is here? I have absolutely no idea, dude. Uh, Joe again, I love all your videos. You make them fun for all of us to watch. Thank you very much, dude. That means heaps. Uh, I am Anstroyer. Episode two, uh, 200 is a live stream, like if you agree. Uh, I'm probably never going to live stream, dude. I don't, I don't like the whole aspect of it. It's, I'm not a fan of live streaming in general because of just how wrong things can go. Um, Dylan, or Dylan, I think it is. It looks like Dylan. I just got a quest for 96% of a quick ascension, but it's two days and it appeared with a common, but he is level six. That's pretty good, isn't it? Sergeant Mufflebunch just hit 600, also great beard. Good job, man, and thank you very much for the comment. Too cute for you. I level up my samurai until he stops insta-killing. Then I put my guilds into Alabaster, or whichever hero I want last, instead of wasting my hero cells one by one. That's fair enough, I mean. As I said, everyone has their own way of doing things, I guess, don't they, guys, at the end of the day? Let me try and actively click these guys down, by the way. Bungie, Mungie, love your gameplay vids. Thank you very much, Bungie. Uh... Funny fart face, oh my god. <laughs> uh, good vids, keep it up, dude. Uh, should, and should I spend 100, 125 souls on an ancient when I have 645? My demigod plus 7 epic died and cost me 9,950 rubies to revive. Holy crap, man. The amount of rubies that you have to spend to revive a mercenary is insane. I guess that's on the, mer uh, the mobile version, isn't it? Um... And you should only spend them souls if the calculator allows you to, pretty much, you know what I mean? Don't go spending souls carelessly, or it won't work out in your favour in the long run at all. Uh, the Mast Samurai is who you need, because if you put all your guilds into the Mast, he will uh, do any an insane amount of damage. That's the way you spelled it there, Robert. Um, yeah, I understand what you mean, Mast Samurai is good, but I still reckon Mast Samurai has his limits. Some people will agree with me, I'm sure, eventually. Uh, Kaden, you're just past me. Why aren't you doing someone you can get over 1k? I don't know, I usually go to 1k and just move on quickly. But it looks like towards these lower levels here, it's getting quite difficult to do that, isn't it? Oh, not the lower level, sorry, the higher level hero. It's getting quite difficult to do that. Boxy Dark Rio, it was fun being in a clan, but I gotta move on to a different clan. It was fun while it lasted, thanks. No worries at all, mate. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, Taron, I'm on stage 834, good job. Liam the Wolf, I can't wait to episode 200 and maybe as an idea you can tell your clan when you record the episode and you can talk to your clan for a bit about episode 200. Yeah, that'd be a pretty good idea, just playing it out with the clan. Interesting, I do like sharing everything with my viewers though in, on the video of course. But yeah, I don't know, I just got golden clicks there by the way. I should have actually reloaded my super clicks then, ah oh, crap. That's alright, we'll just keep trying to one shot these mobs down quickly. Try and get as far as we can here in the game, guys, and I reckon we'll have to ascend. Simple as that. Great vid, so hyped for episode 200. Please do a live stream for your 200 special. So you had George there that said, great vid, so hyped for episode 200. Um, Capo the Legend, please do a live stream for 200. No, sorry, dude, I'm not going to do a live stream. I don't really like live stream too much at the moment. Even though my internet can handle it, I just don't really want to do it. Um, Daniel Trident, when you know you are tired, you energize Clickstorm. Yeah, that's true, you just energize, you get double clicks, don't you? <laughs> I think it is like that anyway, guys, isn't it? You, you double the effect. Uh, he wrote LOL as well. <laughs> uh, what was this, Kieran? People on Clicker Heroes is amazing, on Clicker Heroes I'm very high. Also, why don't you like the difference... Oh, why don't you like a difference between phone and PC video? I guess it means why don't I play P uh, phone clicker heroes? It's because I'm so used to PC now, dude. I don't really see the point of moving on at all. Uh, Michael Game Ninja, I have freaking 400 rubies. WTF? <laughs> Good job, man. You have to start spending them soon. Matthew Bentham, can someone help me out? I'm on mobile. I have transcended four times, but it doesn't give me a bonus hero souls from max transcendent power. Can someone explain to me or help me out to why I don't receive bonus souls? Um, don't you have to level up a certain outsider? Isn't it fan that you have to level up? I think so, isn't it? I don't know. Might be. I don't really play mobile. Sorry, Matthew. When's Clan Clean Out? That's I'm the best ever. That is today. <laughs> and Leet's like, I don't know, it's like a really geeky Leet. So 1337. It's like Leet. <laughs> 
yeah, it's just what hacksers use or hackers. <laughs> it's really just a little goof, I guess, so to, so to speak. I got Kappa multiple times. Rebuild when the five times boost end. That's Godzilla Freak. Uh, play more so you can transcend on 200. That's Godzilla Freak again. Uh, what is your favorite hero in terms of backstory and looks? That's Game 8. I really, really, really liked Beast Lord back in the day because he would smash through the mobs really easily. But I actually like the look of... Uh, hmm, that's a good question. Frostleaf is someone that looks awesome when he's gilded up. I really like the look of Frostleaf. And if you look into these gilded heroes down here, or like the heroes that I haven't unlocked yet, they look quite interesting as well, don't they? But if I had to go with someone, I'd probably go with the Masked Samurai, because he's always helped me through the levels throughout the whole game, you know what I mean? And he's an awesome samurai. But then again, Frostleaf's really good as well. It's a hard choice, it's a hard choice. <laughs> you know, Frostleaf controls ice, for God's sake. Um, Passion Fun, part 200 could be a be a time lapse filled in one long session and multiple sessions. Oh, okay, so he wants like a time lapse sort of. Interesting. Tommy N. No, the reason behind the fact of gilding and hero up to 1500 is about the fact that the next hero would be at level 1000. So taking the advantage of the 10 times bonus right away. Also, by doing that, you assure you keep a gilded hero high enough to keep the gold income balance. In the last episode, you gilded the next coming uh, up and coming hero too fast. You hit a wall with him very fast. That's exactly what I've done. <laughs> That's legit what I've done in this episode. God damn it. I'll just use that click build quickly, smash through the mobs a bit further. About the MS thing, that's my samurai thing. You are not ready for that. When you are able to... No, when you are going to be able to reach web at level 2000 plus easily, then you can go for it. Not before. I guess it's talking about the Mars samurai level stacking. I transcended at 13 ancient souls and now I have to grind all the way back up. Man, it sucks. Yes, it does. But trust me, it does eventually uh, pay off big time. Ancient souls are awesome, you really want them. Simone, I don't get how the spreadsheet and description works. All you do is you, found, like you find your build, whether it be idle or active or whatever, or hybrid, and you just copy exactly what numbers you see there into each outsider. Pinkwa, thanks so much for your help, man. Master Samurai is a big help, and to my surprise, can already ascend for 14 ancient souls. How many souls should I put into my... Now, how many souls should I put into moving my guild into Mars Samurai? Um, dude, put all your guild statuses into Mars Samurai. Like, oh no, he has around 500, okay. Uh, definitely balance it out. Maybe go down to 200 hero souls or, or something like that. What you want is like 25% of 500, you know what I mean? Don't go below that, I'd say, honestly. Now, some comments are waiting through, but what's that all about? Nothing. No comments waiting to approve. Okay, then YouTube just trolled me big time. What's the Gilded status here? That eye. Okay. No worries at all. Let's... Let's... Oh, I don't know. What should we guild here, dude? Let's guild the Masked Samurai back up. We're about to ascend, man. Just a random ascension. Here we go. Gonna buy a quick ascension for... 50 rubies? No, I'm gonna claim the quest, I reckon. I'm legit gonna claim that quest. 40k. 32.7 million souls claimed from that quest. Beautiful stuff. Let's go for the rubies. Um, that's it, guys. I want to ascend. It's over. Done. 171 million hero souls I've just ascended for, guys. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Already have 1.2 million gold on me from one boss, like one mob kill. Holy hell. We are ready to rumble, ladies and gentlemen. This is what I'm talking about. Seriously, dude. That is excellent. My Samurai is pulling off 34.9 trillion damage. Okay. 174Q. Beautiful. Alright, well, I want to end the episode here, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. The countdown to part, or a big episode 200 begins now. Five episodes left. Oh, no, technically tomorrow will be four episodes left. I'll see you all then, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Really hope you all enjoyed this episode. See you tomorrow. See you around.